Parting off is one of the most challenging applications in metal cutting and is always used on turning centers, sliding head machines and multi-spindle machines with a bar feeder. It is often the final operation and a lot of time has already been invested into an almost finished component. A tool failure at this stage can prove extremely expensive. Therefore, it's worthwhile focusing a little extra on this area. And in this episode, we will discuss the main guidelines to ensure trouble-free and successful parting off. There are three main stages of the parting plunge. The main long cut through the bar, the approach toward the end of the cut, and the short stage just before reaching the component center. As the tool is fed deeper, chip evacuation becomes essential, but even if good external coolant setups are used, chips can still get in the way to cause heavy loads and poor component finish. Internal, over and under high precision coolant channeled through the tool provides the highest machining security. With over coolant taking care of chip control and under coolant prolonging tool life and increasing surface speed by between 30 and 50%. Effective parting systems include inserts with a specially developed channel to ensure coolant reaches the right position on the cutting edge. The geometry can then fold and curl the chip, making it narrower than the groove, so that it evacuates without becoming trapped. We recommend starting with the first choice grade and recommended speeds and feeds for the material being machined. A speed that is too low can form a built-up edge on the insert while a feed that is too low increases time in cut and risks more insert flank wear. As the tool reaches the component center, cutting speed decreases below the recommended value, causing a built-up edge and high loads on the insert. To avoid insert breakage and poor chip control, reduce feed by 50 to 75%, two millimeters before the center. This small change in programming provides a large increase in tool life. Always set up the tool with the shortest possible overhang, the recommended maximum being 8 to 10 times the insert width. To avoid tool breakage and rapid flank wear, it is also essential to maintain the center height setting to a tolerance of plus or minus 0.1 of a millimeter. So, there you have it. A short guide to getting the most out of your parting off operations. And to summarize, use the first choice tool and cutting data recommendations. Use high precision coolant whenever possible. And always reduce feed at the component center. For more information, be sure to subscribe and don't forget to visit the Sandvik Coremant website. Mm -hmm.